everybody. Welcome to Crafty Peep and welcome to Crafty Creators Community, the second night on YouTube. Tonight's theme and yesterday's theme was sweet as a peach. And I'm going to show you everything that I did yesterday. We're going to do a little uh, de-stash and then we are going to get down to some crafts. All right. I believe uh, Design and Vine was just on. Hopefully everybody is hopping over to my page and then we will hop. Uh, da, 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 da. Okay. And when we hop over to um, Arrows DIY. So, come on in. I just got off of a um, nether live. We did this little patriotic little fence. I thought that was so cute. Then a little gift bag that you can take a hostess gift over with on 4th of July. And then um, night not quite finished with this. It's going to be that shape, but it's going to be on here. Hi, Bethwin. Good to see you again so soon. Then we did that one. All right. Hey, Tracy. I have been cooking up the storm. So, um, I am going to have to go back and watch Design and Vine. I didn't get to see any of hers. And I'm probably going to miss most of Tracy's, too. She is in the living room, Miss Megan. I wanted her to do a, do a live with me, and she said no. No, 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 no. So, text her. Tell her to get in here and introduce herself. Reintroduce herself. It's been probably a well over a year since she's come on here. Just got back in time from airport dropping my daughter off. Where did she go? Hey, thing one. All right. Let me show you some fun stuff we did yesterday. We're going to add some um, dingleberries or pom-pom balls to the cute little patio pillow. We did a little um, can. Let me... Just tied a little uh, knot in it. When, where, when, where, design, vine, hang on, hang what? Oh. Beth, when, there is your link. Hi, Gigi, good to see you. Hey, Jackie. Twins, ha! Ah! Oh, that is right. Was I the first one tonight? Hi, Charlene. Hi, Tammy, Miss Design and Vine. Okay, you didn't miss anything, guys. I get. I think I'm the first one. Thank you, Jackie. Yes, please hit the thumbs up coming in or uh, heading out. Hello, Miss Fabby with Arrows DIY. She is up next, guys, and um, Potter will be putting her link in. Well, I believe you're a mod on here, so you can put your, pri your own link in. Okay, we did the little buffalo uh, sage green and sweet as a peach and did a cute little uh, fabric uh, bow. Yes, Michelle is on it. Okay. So I guess I was the first one. I was like, ah! I was peeling for mashed potatoes. I was peeling carrots for carrots. Then I put the Mississippi roast in, have my daughter getting the carrots out, and have the daughter uh, mashing the mashed potatoes. <laughs> so we did this on a small little thin uh, canvas, and I thought I added that um, to balance the peach color, and I thought that turned out real cute. And then we did this rag bow with uh, Totally Dazzled, and that is in my link tree. I don't know. The link tree is over on Crafty Peep on Facebook. And um, 
that is just a simple little rag bow that you can put anywhere. Um, yes, you were the first one. All right. Aren't I special? Then we did this little peach tray and made a little uh, rag knot off of the handles and Mod Podge that in there. I think that turned out really cute. And then look what we have, y'all, straight from the store. Sweet as a peach. Sweet as a peach. So hopefully my mom can get me more peaches because that, they're still hard. So what do you put? You're supposed to put them in a paper bag and just put them on your counter for a day or so until they're soft. Anyone? Anyone? <gasps> There's Potter Lynn. Hello? Can you hear me? Hello, hello. Hi. Hi there. How are you? I'm doing kind of crazy, but hey. <laughs> you, you gave oh. me a heart attack. I was like, what? I'm, hang on. Did I miss Divine and Vine? Design and Vine? I was like, what? Thinking Hi, I Randy. got it all wrong. Oh, yeah, that she's happened. always the first one. But then I, I remembered uh, she's going last today. So <laughs> paper bags like, with banana. You tell me I got it wrong. <laughs> Wait, uh, Tracy, to um, to get the peaches ripe, you put it in a paper bag with a banana. I don't have a banana. Uh, my, but my banana is already spotted for two days ago. I bought it. When I don't have time for fresh mashed potatoes, I make instant and add sour cream and butter. Wow, Charlene. Suzanne. Yay. Um. Suzanne, let us know if you want to come on, uh, share the screen with me. If you have time to do a craft or if you have time to take us around on your uh, in your craft room for a tour. Hi, you Suzanne. see that, Bethwin? Suzanne yes, from Alaska. Alaska and craft plane. Yay. All right, y'all. Let's put the pom-poms on here. Well, I can call them dingleberries on here and not uh, get afraid, be afraid of getting jail. <laughs> over there, over there, Mr. FB. Mm -mm, don't use words like that. <laughs> I got this from my mom. Um, I love the big ones compared to the little bitty, bitty, bitty ones. Good to see you all. If you can spread, the, well, I don't even have to say spread the butter. We say spread the butter over on uh, Facebook, but right here you can just say share. So please hit that um, arrow and share it to get more eyes in here. People okay. aren't used to you going on first. People aren't used to you being on at six. Plus, they just Me saw either. you at 4.15 <laughs> and they're like, what? Hang on. No. And they're just thinking, no, nope, something's wrong, not going. Me either. We've uh, changed our time a little bit. Christy needed to um, have a few hours earlier to uh, for her little um, daughter to get her sleep schedule um, in order before she starts kindergarten. But if you can use the F word... Um, over um, on Facebook, you can, Charlene? Well, the room's a mess and still not finished, but the garden is coming together. Well, just uh, uh, Potter Lynn put the, put the link up, so let her know if you want it again. I did. All right. You want me to do it again? I said see, if she doesn't see it. I'll probably just add these to the bottom, guys. And we're going to do some more uh, painting on paint sticks for a little frame. But I'm going to make some pan popcorn. That's a big treat. That was a big treat growing up. And I'm keeping the tradition What's alive. Pan My popcorn. <laughs> I knew you were going to say that. It's, it's popcorn on the stove made with a pan and... Uh, do you mean oil. like? Do you mean like a saucepan or a fry pan? A uh, saucepan. All right. Okay. 
Yeah, that's what we used to do, like a deeper, yeah. like a deep saucepan. I was like, when you say pan, it makes me think it's like some fry pan thing. Gotcha. Little vegetable oil, little salt in there, and oh my goodness. You got to be careful Charlene though. She's Go Charlene's got a cousin that says it all the time, never seen her in jail. <laughs> <laughs> It'd be Murphy's Law. Weird. I don't say that word anyway, but. No, well, I, sometimes me and Potter I say do it. <laughs> We're I saying, have said it. <laughs> it is so adorable. There, Suzanne, it's so adorable to hear uh, Potter say the F word. It's so adorable. <laughs> I'm not saying it here, though. It's only for Miss private. Suzanne, where have you been all of our lives? I don't know. Here, here, all around here, all around this place. Uh, the room is is still not finished. And is in a you know, it's a state, but I'm still going to show you guys how it's how it's. So, you know, I still don't have permanent countertops because I this side. Maybe I should get down so I'm not. And I've done like three other screen. things. Sorry, am I making everybody dizzy walking around? No, there's really not. All right, here we go. I think I'll hop down and I'll come back after Suzanne's finished. So okay. there's not otherwise the screen's too tiny. Okay. Okay. Okay, she's gonna get off. There we go. I can't catch it. Sorry. That was uh, Beth when she's going to come back on when uh, you're done showing us so so we can see more of what you're showing oh. us. Oh, okay. So, <laughs> so uh, Suzanne's here's in the Alaska. top of my hallway. So come up the stairs there, and then we come in the room. Chink, chink. So I have all of these glorious cabinets. And That's looking amazing. Large, glorious door. So three that size and then cabinets, cabinets. <clears throat> and then on this side, I have one over stuff there. But one, two, three, four, five banks of drawers. So nice. And your husband built those for you? No, no, I bought them from Home Depot. And so, okay. you know, like they're sort of relatively, you know, um, pretty good. But I mean, it's winter time. I'm not in here. Um, and then on the end, each end, then there's another 36 minutes for like, I have my main supply stuff there. And then we come over here, and here's my press for um, sublimation. And I bought these tables so I can be standing and working and look out my window. Awesome. Uh, you guys probably can't see it, but, you know, the garage, the yard. <clears throat> so I have a huge work surface with those two tables there. And my printer, and then I have the another and put them together uh makeup station currently ah. <laughs> currently move them figure them in their amazing workspace for um Dang, you're rubber banding pretty bad. Is she rubber banding for y'all or just me? I'm recovering from a complex she type. Aw. Wait, last time I saw you had blonde hair. You're rubber banding your voice. I'm sorry. I'll go out, okay. I'll go back outside. So that's the room. I love it. Oh, she got off. Oh, there she is. Happening. I'm going to jump out. Maybe I'll jump back in. 
Okay. Potter, you want to come back on? Okay, y'all. Let's get it started in here. Let's get it started in here. We're going to take some paint sticks from the Home Depot. Hi, Danielita. I think you, I think you are doing the craft room um, playlist, correct? What you gonna One more time, is this better? It's better for me. Y'all, can you hear Suzanne in the chat or is she rubber banding? No, ma'am, you're not doing it, uh, Danielita. I thought you for sure were. I haven't seen anybody's uh, comments yet, I'll tell you. So are you out by All your right. Well, I'll just tell you. And you can... It's just uh, yeah, me, and this, me and this. Right here. Dang it. Okay, uh -huh. I'll try in some other time. It was so nice to see you guys. I love you. I miss you. I'll still keep oh, watching that. I love that. you. Thanks for Just coming. I'm staying chat. Yay. Bye. 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 Okay. Let's see. Okay. So there's a ruler on the paint stick, and we're just putting that uh, every other, every other one. Oh, you know what? We're gonna keep the ruler side up and um, glue it with popsicle sticks before we paint it. That is so much easier, and I was making it so hard on myself. Um, Potter, you want to stay in the? You want to stay in the chat or? Uh, yeah, do what you want to do. Do what you want to do. Two, four, six, eight. All right, we're going to use eight, y'all. I was going to show you all my huge patch of gorgeous dirt my husband just tilled up. Wow. I will message you. Um, Potter. Hello. Hello. Hey there. Is um is uh, Suzanne in our Discord? She is. Okay, Suzanne, I'll text you next time we're having uh, something over on YouTube. If you, I don't think you do uh, Facebook, so you can come and show us all your um, stuff. I like all the singing from Tammy. Ha <laughs> ha, thing one. You really wouldn't call it singing. I think there's coyotes out there going. Arr! There were so many questions I had for Suzanne. She was uh, rubber banding both times. I know. I think YouTube now just likes to have a little while to settle down. My grandkids think it's, it's magical. Aww. I'm putting my lotion on before I paint good just girl. to let you know i have not received email from auction and you haven't yet charlene nobody has all i did today is box everything up and measure and weigh everything so tomorrow i'm plugging away at the computer but i was on a live yes grocery i'm going to make daughter. your excuses so you don't sound like you're just making lots of excuses tammy <laughs> has been just so busy she's had the grandkids and she's been on craft around the clock twice and she's had all these things on and so in the meantime she's been trying to do that and she's a little bit behind but she's boxed it up and, and it will be going out <laughs> definitely by the end of tomorrow-ish. Well, I'm not okay. going out. I will have all the invoices out. Oh, and then, but that's then, what I mean. The, yeah. the invoices will be going out. Yes. All right. <laughs> So you just use. Oh, uh, she's five. talking about popcorn. Suzanne's talking about popcorn. 
She said, her grandkids think it's magical. They oh, literally that's thought no one had ever seen it pop because it's always been in the microwave bag since oh, the beginning of their time. How funny. And she says, oh, geez, I'm caught up now. <laughs> Charlene goes, figured that. <laughs> Now Charlene got two or three, three or four maybe items from the auction. So you have the biggest box and then Randy Reed um, has a big box and Alice has two different things. How so. lovely of them to be so beautiful and supportive. And I know what it's I like know. as soon as you pay for it, you just, you want it. You want, I want it now. Give it to me. <laughs> Imagine what it's like, Charlene, if you're in Australia. <laughs> I'm in Australia, Tracy. Where you? Tracy's from Australia, aren't you? Aren't you from Perth? I'm from Perth originally, Tracy. I love it. Charlene says, and the gift. I don't know what that means. Do you know what that means? Uh, she was asking Alice Weren't you asking Alice if she received a uh, Pete Postal? Yes. Well, I'm, I'm talking about Tracy at the same time. Oh. Where are you from in Perth, Tracy? So we're going to use some um, um, Waverly Ivory. I thought Tracy would have immediately gone. I Wait, know who that um, accent. That's a Perth accent. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Potter. Yes. Tell me. I usually do uh, antique wax first and then come over with ivory, correct? You do, normally. Okay. That's what you okay. used to do, but sometimes you do it the other way around. Well, today I did oh, the other Armadale. way around. Who? <laughs> She's from Armadale, which is in the hills. It's all green and lush there. And my, for some reason, I don't know why, because she didn't live anywhere near there, but for a while my sister used to get her hair cut there. And I remember when I went over there, I had to drive up there because she bought my niece a GHD hair straightener and I had to go and pick it up. Oh, how funny. <laughs> she said that's why I was asking because she recognised my accent. I had uh, I had a very my best friend lived in Forestfield, so I spent a lot of time in Forestfield and actually a lot of fun, a lot of time. Okay, we're talking about the seventies, eighties here at Forestfield Red Rooster. <laughs> Don't ask me why it was the only place. I love your giggle. It's the best. Charlene All said, right. "No, gonna... you picked the person." From sending you Pete Postal for the month. I don't know what that means. Oh. But who was the winner? Was it Charlene? Charlene, was I it think you? It was Charlene. It was Charlene, yes. It Yay! Was. Okay, so don't forget her present. Whatever you do. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm writing it down Guys, now. Thank you for Can that. You imagine if I you did. forgot. How oh, awful I got to. Well, I got to open your box back up, but that's not not a big deal. Your box was a normal box. Alice's and Randy, everybody else's was a little tricky. Okay. I did actually send you a little note regarding Alice today. Yes. I didn't okay. get a chance to. Uh, I got it right when I was coming on live. And, the and you haven't read yet. it. <laughs> but I was not real thrilled. This is that uh, restaurant paper, y'all, and I did iron it on, and then I Mod Podged over it. But uh, when I Mod Podged uh, over it, it caused it wrinkles. Came but back up. It'll still be cute. That's okay. I don't need anything. Oh no, 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 no. I I'll text you, Charlene, with what I was gonna send you, and you can say, "I'd rather have this or that." It's a this or that. Tracy just dropped her daughter to the airport. She's going to Adelaide. Nice. So it's um just 7.30 in the morning in Perth. So oh, that wow. must have been the crack of dawn. She's originally from the country. We're in the country, Tracy. I've got cousins that come from Beacon. Sorry, I can't help it. It's old home week. Someone from WA get all excited. I miss it a little bit. 
a lot of wit. Phyllis, Phyllis has arrived. Hello, Tammy and Beth. When I'm so glad you're feeling better, Phyllis. I didn't even know you were feeling sick, but I'm sad. Hi, Phyllis. She did. So Brookton. Go oh gosh, I don't know where Brookton is. I'm trying to think. How can I not know where Brookton is? Oh my <laughs> God. You will in about one minute when you look it up. <laughs> Phyllis said, Oh, <laughs> Phyllis actually said, Hell, Tammy and Beth when she meant hello. <laughs> 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 I didn't even notice. Okay, I'm looking up Brooklyn. Okay, on uh, Tracy said, I said, hey, are you supposed to put peaches in a um, paper bag? And she said, yes, banana, paper bag and banana. Yeah. But I don't think you, you put peaches in with a banana in a paper bag? Yeah, because then the banana goes, you know, goes off before the peaches do. I've never All right, heard that. Near Pingley. Oh, and um, yeah, Beverly. Okay. But my, uh, I don't think I got new um, bananas today. Dang it! I wonder if you're you're probably much younger than me, Tracy. Yes, towards York. I had um, sort of well, sort of honorary aunt and uncle who had a place in York. It was wonderful. It was like this old place. I had an old seventy-eight record player and. It was gorgeous and there was ghosts there apparently share the video out guys not that i do not like and appreciate every single one of you but hopefully we can get up to about 30. hey robin Thank good you. to see you so now we're using waverly ivory charlene says that red and white paper looks like shoney's menu i think that's the idea i think it's actually yes that it kind of stuff yeah. It's restaurant paper. Hi, Robin. So Spies a... and DIYs. Oh, thank you, Robin. It's uh, El Natural. My mom told me my hair was uh, dry and brittle and needed to go natural for a while. So I'm enjoying it. It's super easy. Whoa. Hmm. Well, you're probably a bit young to remember the earthquake. It was just like as soon as you're heading out that way, I go, oh, do you remember the earthquake? But you would have been so young, maybe one <laughs> or something. You can take a wipey. Do I have a wipey that's kind of damp in here? Did you say a wipey? A wipey? Oh, a wipey. wipey. Sorry. Right where I put it on, I don't like that thick look, so we're just going to. I hope I'm not annoying you having old home week with Tracy here. No, oh, that's it. fine. It's excitement. <laughs> it's like if right. someone comes on from, you know, Alton and you go, oh my God, do you remember? Do you remember? Do you remember? <laughs> All right, now I got to go back with Waverly Antique because then now I made it too white. Ah, that's unusual for you. You don't usually do that. Well, I put it right on there and I shouldn't have. I knew better, but I didn't do better. Hmm. What are you making again? Uh, just a frame. I love you. I love that rooster hen thing. I think it's just a hen. I don't think it's a rooster, but I love it. What do you love? The 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 hen the, it's new. It's on the shelf next to the in front of the picture you like. The suitcases? So much. No, neck the hen, the rooster. Oh the, the rooster. Um it's been on my desk. It has a little uh happy birthday hat on from Target. And then oh. the little pig has a little birthday. Oh, you can't see my pig up there. There's my pig. Yes, but I remember the pig. <laughs> I do remember Cyclone Tracy. Tracy, I remember where I was. We were in the back garden at my auntie's place. 
when we realised, which was actually Christmas Day afternoon that the news came through, which is incredible because it was like at least 12 hours after the cyclone hit. That's so funny, you know, 74, that's what it was like. Wow. I had friends who were evacuated from there. Cyclone Tracy was this devastating cyclone that hit Darwin. Speaking of Darwin, that's Suzanne's husband's name. But anyway, <laughs> um, Darwin was a city in Northern Territory. It was completely flattened by oh, Cyclone gosh. Tracy. And, of course, it was 1974 and they were cut off because they were a very isolated city. And it, there was a whole big airlift to rescue everyone and everything. Yep. Uh, Robin, I'm just queen. making a, a paintbrush, a paint stirrer frame. I don't even think we're using it tonight. But I just wanted to show you how easy it is to make these. So it's with uh, eight paint sticks and then Waverly uh, Antique and then come over it with Waverly Ivory. Okay. Now we're going to open a little happy mail. Uh, not Hang happy on, mail. What? Nope, nope. Just Pete Postal. Well, that's better, huh? <laughs> no, I, ha I like Pete Postal better. I this know, is, no, that's this, what I said. I, I know, but um, I said it wrong. This is D-Stash. D-Stash. So we shall Interesting. See. She's really mixing it up, folks. <laughs> we'll see what's in the box. Do well, you know what's after, in the box? Yesterday, I made six peach crafts in one hour. So we are going to do a peach craft, but I already showed you what I made yesterday. So I'm just chilling a little bit. Do you remember that children's book called Each Peach Pear Plum? Never heard of it, but I know James and the peach. The giant peach. Yep, the giant peach. By well, Roald Dahl. Sometimes it's hard to get into these boxes. Every time you say peach, I want to say each peach pear plum. Each peach pear plum. Yeah. <laughs> Aw, love this. Uh, a little um, tea towel. When life gets hard to stand, kneel. Love that. Aw. Oh, good. I was hoping this was what was here. Some cherries. Three cherries. You know I do things in threes. But I did buy two sets of strawberries. Isn't that oh, fun? Oh, gorgeous. Beautiful. Three things of oh, watermelon. Isn't that Where cute? did you get these from? Um, Is it from Margie? I think it's from Margie. From uh, D-Stash Central. And then some grapevine. Little, four grapevine wreaths. Hmm. And it wouldn't be a picnic without some ants. <laughs> oh, you know that little square thing you just did? Is that a picnic? Oh, I know. I think she has bigger ants, though. I'll see. Oh. Uh, I was going to do something. Doesn't that look like it could be a picnic layout? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, that was fun. Oh, so cute. Ants in my pants. Did you have that game, Phyllis? It was <laughs> a plastic pair of pants and the little ants, plastic had ants, have little bitty you have tabs to on them. The ants in. <laughs> we used to have, there was an underwear company here called Ants Pants. Oh, how funny. And there was a really cool ad that went with us. Sick them, Rex. <laughs> All right, we are going to. Um, yes. Phyllis asks if they're chocolate covered. 
but I have never it had a monkey cover and ant or a roach, but that I know of. That I know of. Um, Phyllis said, and cooties too. I know cooties. They're so cute. Yes, with the echidna, Tracy. <laughs> oh, she took it away. I know what you mean. These are just those little bitty pallets from the Dollar Tree. Rex the echidna. That's right. Sick on Rex. <laughs> Rex, the an echidna, an echidna is a spiny anteater. And they named him, the mascot was Rex? Oh, it was just a particular ad for oh, underpants. Gotcha. <laughs> <laughs> and there were some ants. So. Oh, my gosh. Everyone's like, we're stooping very low today. Charlene's now talking about have, if asking if you've eaten frog legs. Oh, I love frog legs. I haven't had them. Well, oh no, I had him about two years ago at a, after a wedding in New Orleans. Uh, me and my friend went with another family into the bar area, and he ordered them, and I liked them. I'd had him when I was a little girl. Anything fried. Well, no, I take that back. I don't want to eat fried liver. <laughs> I was going to say anything fried is good. <laughs> yeah, Abby didn't want to craft with me. Why is she being so mean? Don't know. She wanted to come in She's here on holidays, is that right? She said, uh, summertime has begun. She ordered an $80 swimming pool. Because Bob threw her old one away outside. It gets slimy. <laughs> tastes like chicken, if I remember. It tastes like a mixture between chicken and pork to me. Hi, Lori B. So I said, I and then she, we could not find her raft to lay out on. And so I had, had to buy a new one of those as well. Before I had to run into Walmart, I had a half hour. Um, before my craft around the clock section. So I was oh buzzing. Gosh. And then I was peeling potatoes and carrots. And I said, she was watching a movie. And I said, hey, did you um, get in the pool with the, the the raft? No. I go, well, then I didn't have to go get it tonight. <laughs> Fried chicken livers are yummy. Oh, no, Phyllis. You can have mine. <laughs> Look at what Charlene says afterwards. Love liver and onions. Woo! No. My mom and dad yeah, do too, Tracy y'all. says what she calls it. Two <laughs> mad cats at moment. We call that lamb fry. Do the livers come from lambs? I don't know. Uh, but it, that is what it's called. It's an English term. I don't want to look it up. Do not. <laughs> Do severely not. triggered <laughs> don't get triggered she's no. a vegetarian y'all vegan not vegetarian yeah. vegan how what's is it, there a difference between that that obviously yep vegetarians don't have anything that is derived from animal sorry vegans don't have anything that's derived from animals vegetarians will generally eat dairy products okay. or honey as well and stuff like oh, that okay Gotcha. We and we don't eat honey or milk or cheese or anything like that. Okay, we're going to mix is. pumpkin, orange with peach and white to put a little um, dry brush of peach color on here. So let's let's mix that together. Charlene is begging to differ with Tracy regarding whose liver it is. Laurie says people here are wrapping pickles with bacon strips and some seasoning. Laurie says liver is gross. <laughs> okay, uh, Charlene. 
okay. Okay. My issue. What did everybody have for dinner? Now everyone's going to say they had liver for dinner. They <laughs> 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 had some liver, um, I ate his liver with some fava beans and a nice Chianti. <laughs> All right, let's see what color we get with this. All right, I like it. I'm going to have sausages and bread for dinner. Isn't that disgusting? But my friend Lindley said, I've got to have these sausages. So these new sausages called V-Series. She swears they're fantastic. So I've ordered them and they came this morning at 5 a.m. And so I'm having sausages and bread like Basically, what's known here is a sausage sizzle or a democracy sausage, anyway. <laughs> but it's a fake um, sausage, right? Well, yeah, it's, well, it's a sausage. I mean, sausage isn't, you know, sausages are just talk, talking about a shape. No, yes, sausage is usually non -meat. pork. It's a non-meat sausage. Gotcha. Yes. But tastes like sausage. Well, I don't know. I can't remember what meat tastes like. It, it's savory of some description. Okay. All right, y'all. You know, I've had We're a lot of dry breath. I've had a lot of vegan sausages, and and they quite frankly mostly make me feel blur, like they're grainy or something. You know, they they're weird. But my friend Lindley swears she keeps saying, "Why haven't you gone and got them? I recommended them. Don't you think I, my recommendations are important?" So I promised her on Sunday that I would get some. <laughs> you know, they're talking about Silence of the Lambs. And then Charlene said she had chicken broccoli Alfredo. And Charlene has iron pill. Um, Laurie says Charlene, has I have iron pills for that. She has iron pills for chicken broccoli Alfredo. No, Phyllis instead of liver. Leftover like we had to eat liver growing up because oh, it's higher. Oh, I missed that bit. Sorry. Tracy had peanut butter toast for breakfast. Uh, Phyllis had leftover Salisbury steak. I forgot what Salisbury steak is. Is that really thin steak? Or uh -huh. Okay. Gigi's back because hubby was talking. What did All you right. eat for dinner, Gigi? Or what are you going to have for dinner? I wonder where... Have you seen Mandy, Gigi? I miss her. I'm sure you have. A little bitty cling wrap over that. I guess I'm out of the little paint things that I keep get at the party section at the Dollar Tree that has a little lid on it to keep your paint. You need to get yourself an egg carton. Yeah, there's really not room for that up here. <laughs> <laughs> so I yeah, keep them sorry, in little sorry. party containers and they stay for almost a month, really. That's dry. Oh, my so God. For a long time there's only yeah. there's only 16 minutes to go oh my gosh the time just flew ah uh, i had leftover pork potatoes celery carrots and mushroom jimmy wow um mm, after me is potatoes, uh, carrots. arrows diy yeah. she is funny little thing and her um <laughs> funny little thing a funny little thing she makes me laugh i love her um she probably doesn't even try to be funny, and she's funny. But, um, y'all, she says, is. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Krabby. <laughs> and on my channel, I like to do high-end dupes. Da -da -da -da. <laughs> um, she has four boys and a girl, y'all. I say she has one short of a basketball uh, team and a cheerleader. <laughs> but she's thinking about it. Yeah, she is. And she homeschools. What? Oh, great. Yeah. 
Um, Gigi talked to Mandy today. She's doing good. Can you please give her my love? Phyllis says, Favi is precious. And Charlene said, everyone do you. And I don't know if she's saying everyone do you or she's missed out the end of her sentence. So I didn't repeat it thinking she was going to write the rest. But she might be saying, you know, everyone, you do you. Just do yeah, you. Yeah, that's what we say here. Do you. I'm sure she is too, Gigi. It's like 11 p.m. at night, right? Damn. Where Gigi is? Where? Oh, where Mandy is. Where Mandy is, yeah. Yeah. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 12.45. She's in England, right? Yes. Yeah. I think they're six hours ahead. So these, this just says sweet as a peach. Baby says, this is a mad house. I think she means her own house. Almost ready. Ah. <laughs> Randy Reed says, sounds gross. I'm not sure which she thinks sounds gross. <laughs> <laughs> what, 12 Liver and onions, probably, or frog legs. Who knows? <laughs> Or maybe the vegetarian sausages. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Gigi says you are perfectly right, Tammy. And Charlene says I'm perfectly right. So it is you do you. All right, this says sweet as a peach, but you can't see it. I don't know no, why you're my bright. So your your brights, your light's so bright. I can't see anything. I think that's why I'm so distracted tonight because I can't really see what you're doing. Everything's so bright. And y'all, I still have to make crafts and do a video tonight. Sweet as you I think it's going to happen. Oh, it's going to happen. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> You poor thing. I just feel so. Oh my god! I don't know how you do it. You're amazing. So much pressure. <laughs> I, w I think I would have a migraine by the end of it. I would be like, oh, it's too much. Can't do it. It's crafting. Sweet okay. as a peach. So these are cute little shelf leaners. Cute little tear tray cute little hostess gifts um let me see i want to put you know this. your peaches that you've got they look yeah. like nectarines to me they don't look like our peaches i know i got nectarine in peaches but i think those were peaches because the nectarines okay. i have in the refrigerator who knows shay is here hello shay how are you feeling hi shay did you have the best sleep of your entire life Shelley I didn't know she you was have a to love what you survivor. Do. Pardon? I didn't know Shay was a cancer survivor. Yeah, I didn't either. She said, I did. Did they make you eat sandwiches when you woke up? Tracy says, peaches are furry and nectarines are not. And also, I don't know if you have them there, but over here, we have two kinds of peaches, except now they've changed it to the other way around. But they always were when I was little. They were freestone and clingstone. But I think they also divide them up as yellow and white. So which kind do you have, yellow or white? I've heard of white. Uh, well, there's white peach juice, but these right. are uh, yellow peaches. Right. 
which I would call them free stone. Like when you eat them, does the stone come loose really easily or is the pulp stuck uh, to it? Um, if it's real ripe, it, it'll come out no problem. If it's uh, mm. like if it's tangerine is a little ripe and I try to eat it, then it doesn't come out too easy. I'm a, I'm a much bigger fan of free, free stone. stone peaches. But the peaches are not the same as they were in my youth. They were so tasty. And now invariably they're flowery and just get so disappointed. Huh. All right. I Where's my time? Okay, I got 10 minutes, y'all. Let's see. Jay said, no, she didn't get sandwiches, but she did go get two bacon cheeseburgers after that. Wow, really? Talk about counteracting all the good work you might have done for the colonoscopy. <laughs> what you should all have right. done was gone and got some spinach and some greens. That's what's good for your colon, girly. Sorry, can't help it. I'm pontificating here. My colon was awesome and I am not vegan. <laughs> I, do, I, do I know, and my salads. colon wasn't. And I said to my doctor, <laughs> pointing at myself, I went, but vegan. <laughs> and he went, but her hereditary. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, both my mum and my granddad died of it, so. Aw. All right, we're just going to do a beaded. Um, let me see. Let me move you down here. Charlene says yellow. So I think she's saying in Texas there's yellow. Even though we now know that Charlene is in Massachusetts, how do you know what's going on in Texas if you're in Massachusetts? <laughs> Gigi says, that's right, Tracy. As a child, I had the hardest time washing the fuzz off. You cared about the fuzz? Wow. <laughs> Shay said, I was starving. All right. <laughs> hey this is a judge free uh channel people. yes i'm being so judgy stop being so judgy Beth. <laughs> <laughs> i apologize you're adorable Bella says shay i do the same thing after my colonos colonoscopy whatever i want yeah, she couldn't go with us to lunch because she had one recently. She had to prep? Uh. Yep. yep. I just hate it because I am vegan, right? They, they were trying to make me eat sandwiches, and, of course, they didn't have any non-vegan sandwiches. And I was just like, oh, I'll be all right. And they were like, nope, you're eating something. I was like, Wait, I'll afterwards they make you eat something? Yeah. Not us. Well, they were making me eat something. <laughs> they were trying to, they made me have juice and then they made me eat some sandwiches. And I was like, but uh, the ham and cheese, I'll just remove those. And I said, oh, there's butter. Is this butter margarine? And they said, no, it's not vegan. <laughs> I was like, God. And I didn't mean to be a pain. I wouldn't have been a pain, but it's just my principles. Right. I can't help it. Oh, Gigi Jardine says that peach fuzz itches her lips. Huh. Tracy says we have yellow and now white peaches and nectarines. You sure do. And Charlene says... I'm a breast cancer survivor. See, another one. Going Aww. in for endometrial cancer surgery soon and hopefully nothing else. Oh, everything's crossed for you, Charlene. Oh, I love you. I'm a cervical cancer survivor and a slightly, very close to, but not quite, <laughs> um, precancerous polyps anyway. All right, so we did a peachy kind of. Gigi, uh, she's making various, a whole bunch of different. I, I, she, I think she 
calls them hostess gifts, like small crafts that you can give away as gifts to hostesses. Um, to, oh, you know, she doesn't get on Facebook, business. dang it. There's pictures. And, well, there's pictures on Crafty Creators Community if she gets on that. Well, yes. And also, but you can also use them in tier trays or, you know, in a combo kind of little setup. So yesterday she made six. She had like a tin with flowers in it. She had a big tray. She had a, uh, what else did you have yesterday? You had several oh. little little lemons of different pillow. Oh, yeah, a pillow, little outside pillow. A rag bow with totally dazzled in the center. That's right. And you had another little bow as well on the tray, didn't you? Oh, yes. They're all on the theme. See? Can you see, Gigi? Okay, I have four. Uh, could I please have three minutes? To yes, absolutely, Fabby. Yeah, I get to start on my bow with y'all. Or not bow. Um. <laughs> Something. Yeah. Uh, Tassel? Crystal, thank you. Okay. <laughs> Crystal. Crystal Herrera says, hi, y'all. Hello, Crystal. Hi there. Lovely this to see you. This is just from uh, the Dollar Tree. What do you mean she's from the Dollar Tree? This yarn is from the Dollar Tree. Oh. I thought you said Crystal I was from the Dollar Tree. 20, well, they might have been $30. I dropped my other pair of these glasses in... Uh, broken, but um, they they cut right there, and the glass frame fell out or lens. And um, I was at UPS mailing back my dresses I'm not going to wear to my niece's wedding, and um, some car enamel that Debbie Riggs uses for outside projects because you. It, it's if you get it clear and do your projects it can withstand 150 degrees but walmart wow. sent me silver instead of clear so i had to send it back oh. my i couldn't get my printer to work for the label so i had to pay two dollars and 30 cents for friggin the label but it's 17 dollars, i think so i was still getting 15 dollars back all right y'all we're going to do a little tassel. Guess what Shay just said. What? Guess what Shay just said. Trey? Shay? Shay? Me oh, not Shay. Shayla. Okay, she yeah, said, Shay. Your room is so organized, Tammy. <laughs> I love you, Shay. <laughs> I did work on this to make it more presentable. All right, we're doing 40. Go ahead and talk, uh, uh, Potter. No, I don't want to distract you from 40. I'm not John C. Okay. So cut that off. So, why, Randy Reed, why are you saying liver and frog's legs? Are you behind by any chance? <laughs> or did you want me to yell that out to distract her while she was wind, winding? <laughs> and why, I, I did want to say, why are you using your paint packet when you're meant to be using the comic card now? Well, I used a um, plastic wrap. <laughs> Uh, canvas that I got from the Dollar Tree the other day, but I used it today. Okay. So then you just cut the bottoms. Shake it out. Shake. Ooh. Shake it out. All right. Gigi, then you're gonna that's, do... that's bordering on a dead joke. <laughs> what? Shake? Shake it out? No, Gigi said if you eat frog's legs, the frog has to use crutches. Oh. <laughs> now you just do a tie it off to the top. Uh, let me get that back on there. Okay. 
Not supposed to be this difficult, people. Okay, just tie it at the top like a regular tassel would be tied. Double tie it. And then those are the two strings that you just tie that with and then flip it over. I don't know where this light is coming from, but it is driving me crazy. Beautiful. And now you're going to give it a haircut. A haircut. If you'd asked me that a year and a half ago what you're going to do now, I couldn't tell you. But can <laughs> <now>. <laughs> you can now. Yep. So it's a little off-white, and we're going to tie it here to the end. Maybe Fabi will come back in and say, okay, done. I hope. So. I think she will. It's only one minute, so um, she's got two minutes of her three minutes still to go. Cupcake is in the house. Ah, so there we go. And then, of course, go ahead. I was just thinking, you know, she's not expecting you to be on this early. So, I love the gold. It's very blingy. Hi there. Beautiful cupcake. Now we're just going to take two flowers i think we got these from the dollar tree and we're gonna cut off that little green stem thing and then we'll hot glue them back to back with the end of this lori b says she always gets those slanted do you mean the haircut or something else she always gets those slanted. Yeah. Oh, when you when you t do your tassels, it, it's uh, um, it's um, crooked. Hmm. Kinky tassels. <laughs> we don't got no kinky tassels here. Straight I don't vanilla. Mind a kinky tassel. <laughs> straight, straight vanilla tassels here. <laughs> well, peachy ones anyway. Yes. So, little uh, peach Tracy color. Saying, Thank you for information about craft pack, but I look for Lincraft. There's not in WA. There's also, do you have Spotlight there, Tracy? You can always ask me because I will give you the closest, nearest that we can have in Australia because I do check into it. But of course, we don't have Waverly, but we do have. Okay, homes. I'm ready. Thanks so much, sweet peep. Oh my gosh. All right, everybody, let's hop over to Arrows DIY. I will be in the chat until we see each other again, sweet peeps. Stay crafty. Arrows Thank DIY. You. Thank you, Bethwin. Night, Thank everybody. You. Bye.